Thank you to the Academy for recognizing this. At the 95th Academy Awards, Ruth E. Castle made history, becoming the first black woman to win two Oscars. Five years after winning Best Costume Design for Marvel's Black Panther, on Sunday she took home her second one for its sequel, Black Panther Wakanda Forever. Listen, I, I, I pulled myself up from my bootstraps. I started, you know, a single parent uh, household. I wanted to be a costume designer. I studied, I, I, I scraped. You know, I dealt with adversity in the industry that sometimes didn't look like me. And I endured. So I, I feel that this win opens the door for other young costume designers that you know, may not think that this industry is for them and hopefully they'll see me and they'll see my story and they'll think that they can win an Oscar too. And the Oscar goes to everything, everywhere, all at once. It was a fantastic night for the superhero fantasy. It took seven awards with the coveted Best Picture Oscar as icing on the cake. I think one of the things that I realized growing up was that the, one of the best things we can do for each other is shelter each other from the chaos of this crazy world we live in. Michelle Yeoh. Michelle Yeoh made Oscar history, becoming the first ever Asian woman to win Best Actress, and yes, you've guessed it, for everything, everywhere, all at once. For all the little boys and girls who look like me watching tonight, <laughs> this is a beacon of hope and possibilities. This is proof that dreams dream big and dreams do come true. And ladies, don't let anybody tell you you are ever past your prime. <laughs> Never give up. And the Oscar goes to... Brendan Fraser. The whale. Best actor went to Brendan Fraser for The Whale, in which he plays Charlie, an overweight, reclusive gay English teacher who tries to restore his relationship with his teenage daughter. Oh, my goodness.